gameplay with a Wii controller. Um, Pop, pissed off things have been coming along pretty good. We're about a week into uh, the Kickstarter, of a four week Kickstarter. Um, so far so good, we're about a quarter of the way to our goal. Uh, my only concern is that uh, most people are back, probably going to back in the first week, I would think. So, even though we're a quarter way there, we have about a quarter of uh, the backing, I'm worried that it's going to drop off. So I just wanted to give you guys a little update. Um, game's coming along good. I'm still working on the game, still working on videos, um, adding new characters. So far I've got three different Tux characters you can shoot. A Batman Tux, a Superman Tux, and a regular Tux. You've got different types of material they can collide into, wood, concrete, uh, both green and red kryptonite for the Superman Tux all affect the different Tuxes different ways. Um, and each Tux has their own little special ability, such as Super Tux, you can somewhat control his flying. Um, the Bat Tux has batarangs that you can throw, as you've probably seen in the videos uh, that you can, uh, the previews of the game. Um, I've had a lot of people uh, offer to uh, help me with artwork, which is the one place I definitely need help. Also, I've had a number of people uh, say that they would like to back me, but they don't have a credit card and, um, and Kickstarter only accepts credit cards. Uh, now, once we've reached our goal, I'll put a place where people can donate other ways. I just don't want to have a second way to donate because with Kickstarter, if we don't reach our goal, then we don't get any of the money. So, uh, I don't want to have more than one place for people to uh, sign up to donate. Um, also, if the project takes off, Obviously have a store with things like t-shirts and other stuff like that they can purchase to help support the project. Um, I'm actually having a lot of fun, a lot more fun than I thought I was going to creating this. So um, hopefully if for some reason we don't reach our goal at Kickstarter, we I might continue to work on this and see if I can just get people to back me through store purchases. Uh, we'll see. I mean, it probably won't be as complete if we don't reach our goal at Kickstarter, but, uh, but definitely I've already got a lot done, so I'll probably clean it up a little bit and finish it up without adding, uh, being as in-depth as I would if we reach our Kickstarter goal. Um, I thank you everyone who has back, backed us up on Kickstarter. Those of you who haven't, um, I ask that you think about doing it. Uh, if you have a credit card, because every dollar helps, and I mean that literally. You can donate as little as one dollar over at the Kickstarter site, and if half of my viewers, half of my subscribers on YouTube were to donate a dollar, we would have reached our goal already. So don't think that a dollar isn't worth donating, because it is. Um, so I just wanted to bring that across. Um, also, you may have noticed yesterday, Thanksgiving Day, happy day after Thanksgiving by the way guys, um, I have posted other videos, uh, other tutorials. I don't want to think you guys, I want you guys to think that I'm forgetting about all the other tutorials while I'm working on this. I'm putting a lot of extra time and effort into creating pop, but um, I'm not going to stop doing my regular weekly tutorials. So uh, I'll put up some annotations over here. Uh, and I did tutorials too on bash scripting. Uh, two musical uh, uploads uh, and uh, two on uh, Pi Game. So six new videos for you guys to check out uh, for right now. And those of you who have, uh, you know, uh, sponsored me, backed me through Kickstarter, uh, should have received a link uh, with username and password to the project files as of right now. And once again, everything will be made public eventually. I just want to make sure that people who are backing me get a special bonus of getting the files first. Um, so everything, all the files and videos, the game, everything will be open to everybody eventually. Just trying to give uh, the backers a little uh, special thing for backing me. Um, that's about it. I thank once again everyone who has been uh, backing me. and. Uh, I hope that this project uh, is able to continue. Uh, Trying to put a lot of time and effort into it right now, even before we've reached our goal, so that even if the goal isn't met, we'll have something usable. But I'd like to have a football game with a bunch of levels and different bad guys, and fun little hidden things, and cheat codes, and 
once again, that everything is being recorded from beginning to end so that you guys can see every step of the way, every mistake I made, everything, everything I've done in the game so far, I pretty much have changed the way I've done it three times. So you can see how I originally thought about doing stuff and as I went along I was like, oh, it's probably better if I do it this way, let's redo that. So um, hopefully I learned a lot myself from doing this. I already have learned a lot as far as 2D games in Blender. And um, my hopes is to, if this project is a success, to work on other games. Uh, because the, the more I work on it, the better I get at it, and the quicker I can make stuff, because I'm not fumbling around redoing stuff, trying to make it better than what I, trying to do it the way that I should have done it originally, is what I'm saying. So, you know, uh, thank you again for watching. Keep on watching. Uh, once again, if you haven't, uh, you know, signed up to back me, I ask that you do. Like I said, a dollar, literally a dollar would help we have enough people doing that. So and for people who don't have credit cards or for some reason can't use the Kickstarter to back me, um, once we've reached our goal, I'll set up some place where you can buy merchandise or donate to the project. It's just right now I don't want two places for people because I don't want to fail at Kickstarter because people donate somewhere else. So um, that's it. Also remember the game is going to be cross-platform. It's using a Blender game engine. Uh, and I'm going to show you how to package it for Linux and Windows and there will be packages available for both Linux and Windows that you just download executables and, and run them. Uh, and uh, I don't have an Apple computer so I can't test it, although the game should run on Apple. I do know uh, uh, I have a friend who works for Apple and maybe I can get him over here and we can package it up and go through that for uh, Mac users just to make it easier. The game will run on Mac either way, it's just hopefully we can get it so there's easy, uh, you know, easily packaged, so you just unzip it and click on the run button. Anyway, I'm going to keep on playing with this. Uh, it's actually pretty fun to play with a Wii controller, and I'll have tutorials on that if we reach that point in, in production. So uh, keep on watching, check out the tutorials. And, uh, thank you for everyone who's offering to help with artwork and music and stuff like that. Hope that you all have a great